It's a great day for hockey cards, and today we're going to take a look at 2019-2020 Upper Deck Tim Hortons. Got 10 packs here. We're going to open those up. But before we do that, I'd like to remind everyone of our contest. Uh, right now we are running a contest to celebrate our 1,000th, 1,200th, and 1,400th subscribers. And what we're giving away is, first thing we're giving away is we're giving away two of these lots What's in these lots? 45 cards, Beckett high value of at least $140. And in each one of these are two hits, which are autograph or memorabilia cards. Lots of good stuff in these. Uh, parallels, inserts, star cards, rookies. Cool stuff. The other thing we're giving away is this box of SP Retail. Uh, chance of getting an autograph or jersey card in each box. So we're going to have three winners for this contest, which goes on until October 22nd. If you'd like to enter the contest and win this, check out the description below and follow the instructions, and it'll tell you how you can enter. And as always, thank you for watching and thank you for subscribing. So let's get into what we're really here for is our Tim Hortons. Now I'm gonna list this as a new release video. However, these have been out for a couple weeks. I live in the United States, so we don't get this promotion, or at least there's no Tim Hortons around me uh, where I can get these cards. So I usually have to get them off of eBay and uh, get them shipped in. So let's take a look at these. You've probably seen these. I think every breaker on YouTube has done a video of these cards at this point because they're, they're inexpensive. They're inexpensive. I actually think they're good-looking cards. Oh, we're going to start off with a Sid the Adult game day action. Oh. Oh. And immediately, right off the bat, we've got a redemption for the 2019 number one NHL draft pick. Wow. Wow. That is super awesome. I've never pulled a redemption from Tim's. I guess that's two hits in the same pack, too, again. We got Crosby, and we got Jack Hughes. That's crazy. Man, I don't know what the odds are on that, but uh, that's, that's kind of awesome. Completely unexpected. Uh, so here's the base cards. Shea Weber, uh, as I mentioned... Upper Deck does a really good job of creating a look for a lot of their series, and they maintain it from year to year, and this is pretty consistent with what we've seen in the past from Tim Hortons. There's the back. They use the same photo that's on the front, and they just kind of zoom in on the head. And you'll see that uh, these cards have, like, an embossing to them. So on the front, like, the player is, like, 3D kind of, kind of sticks out, and you can kind of see the outline of the player there. On the back and the light. So overall, I like the design of the cards. I've always liked the Tim Hortons cards uh, as far as design goes. So let's get into it. I'm curious. I don't know any of the odds. I didn't show you guys either. Uh, so let's take a look and let's see what these odds are on these packs. Let's zoom in there. Wow, does that say that the number one draft pick redemption is 1 in 12,000? That's crazy. That's crazy. 1 in 12,000. I think we just hit a 1 in 12,000 redemption, guys. That's insane. That is absolutely crazy. Uh, Mira Heiskanen. We've got a highly decorated insert of Alexander Ovechkin. That's what the back of that one looks like. There's all the awards that he's won throughout his illustrious career. And we've got P.K. Subban. We've got Marc-Andre Fleury. And we've got a red. These are new this year. These are red parallels of the base set. So we've got a red Sebastian Ajo. Carolina. Really cool. 
and Blake Wheeler for the Winnipeg Jets. Dylan Larkin, and we've got a game day action of Johnny Hockey. That's kind of nice. It's got a little highlight of an actual game in there. I hope that the picture is actually from that game, because that's kind of cool. Brent Burns. San Jose off to a little bit of a rough start this year. We've got Roman Yossi. And we've got a winter classic. Bruins defeat Blackhawks at Notre Dame. Patrice Bergeron. These are just celebrating the different special events throughout the NHL season. And we've got Brady Kachuk. Alexander Radulov. And we've got a red parallel of Ryan Paling. He's a much touted prospect for the Habs. Alex Debrinkat from Chicago. Martin Jones. And we've got a gold etchings of Alex Ovechkin. They did these last year as well. I think I like the design better last year as opposed to this year. Joe Thornton. Three packs left. Thomas Chabot. And we've got a highly decorated Braden Holpe. With his Jennings, Vizina, and of course, his Stanley Cup. And Gino. Leon Dreisaitl, Alex Ovechkin, game day action, celebrating a four goal game, and Mitch Marner. Jake Gensel, the red parallel of Ovi. And Philip Forsberg. But really, the story of this break, ladies and gentlemen, is this right here. 2019 number one NHL draft pick redemption card, which I think the odds are 1 in 12,000 on this guy. If I read that right. If I didn't, let me know in the comments. But uh, that's... Much more than I expected uh, in terms of this break. Uh, I've watched a lot of breaks of this already because I knew I'd be getting mine late. Seems like a common belief amongst the breakers, at least, is that these are cards that are kind of meant for beginners or whatever. And I'm sure it's gotten a lot of people into the hobby. I actually really like these cards. I mean, I think we get the term beginner and expensive confused a lot in the hobby. I think you can enjoy collecting lower end sets and not be a beginner. I really like opening Tim Hortons cards. I think there's a lot of people that really enjoy these cards and I don't think it's a beginner set. I think collect what you want, whether you're a beginner or not. If you like the set, you should absolutely collect it. But, uh, anyway, that's my two cents on the issue. Uh, I want to thank everybody for watching. Head out on Philip Forsberg. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you like the channel, please subscribe. Don't forget to check the directions below for instructions on how you can enter our contest. And we will see you next time with another break.